All right, with what's up, Title Nation? We've got a board brief Tuesday, March 9th. Three rounds for the warm up, 30 seconds side plank on each side, 30 seconds of bird dogs, and then 30 seconds of elevated clamshells on each side as well. Our prep work we got three rounds, 10 floor slides, 20 half kneeling press holds on each side, and then 20 scorpions. We review the movements for the workout. Go over and make sure everyone knows what's going on and then perform five rounds okay um, of the bear complex every round consists of doing this seven times okay so the first movement is a dumbbell power clean followed by a dumbbell front squat followed by a dumbbell push press and then another dumbbell front squat and then another dumbbell push press that's one round or that's one set switch arms and then continue on until we we'll finish seven sets. And then you rest, right? And then when you're recovered enough, you'll do it again, you'll start round number two. If you watch Rob's video, um, the video link that's posted in Sugar Rod, that's how, that's how we're doing it, okay? So a little bit of breakdown on the workout. We're obliques with abs, okay? Um, just getting the stabilization, doing our shoulders and hips here for the bird dogs. And clamshells, good exercise for our glutes to get fired up. All right, we're going to challenge our flexibility with these floor slides. Um, so I've seen a couple video or I've coached classes, and I've seen a couple classes of going through the floor slides. I'd like everyone to probably try to slide, slow down a little bit, right, and really pin their shoulders back uh, and their low back on the ground, and really challenge their mobility instead of just doing this we're not challenging ourselves like that right so slow the movement down really work on the thoracic mobility and upper back mobility okay um, and that's going to help with these half kneeling presses where we got to lock out our arm and just hold the dumbbell overhead uh, low back release on these scorpions shoulders good stuff there um, and then so I forgot to mention the finisher after the workout we're going to do a two minute goblet squat hold um, sitting on the wall Right, so a wall sit just with our hips just below parallel. If the goblet holds too much weight for you, we can put the weight in our lap, hold it like that, or we can just put the weight on the floor. Right, so very challenging to sit in that position for a whole two minutes. Right, for the workout, um, if you got more than 50 or 35, use a heavier dumbbell if you'd like. Right, um, and let's get these seven rounds done with moving with some consistent accuracy. Right, we want to be moving well, power cleans, front squats, push press. That's really focusing on the technique here. Um, yeah, and it's gonna be challenging over the seven sets every time we go. All right, so have fun with the bearish dumbbell complex uh, and we'll see you guys tomorrow.